Let's see, will that do it? Hey, that worked. All right. Now let's line them up. Oh, they're going to be able to jump over that, aren't they? Okay, the morning of day seven, we're going to do some final things to the horde base. And then I think we're gonna have enough time. I might run a mission and then we'll come back here and get ready for the horde. I believe I have a point I can spend. Debating on how to spend it, I think I wanna go into a little bit of the fortitude deal here so I can start putting points into my gut. My food and stamina is proven to be an issue. So we're gonna do that. Very good, I think from there, there we go. And be one more point for that, which we are very close to having. All right. A little bit of food on us. Drop off our dukes. Let's see. Almost have a bottle of water. All right, I think we'll go gather a little bit. Do some final touches to our horde base. Then we come back and just attack a horde. Whoa, lady. Knock it off. Oh, I see another. Hey, we got a bag out of her. A little bit of food. Uh huh, I see ya. Easy, Marvin. Aren't you down? Hey, and there's our level. Alright, when well our stand was rebuilt, let's go ahead and put that right into Strong Constitution, I think. Reduce food and water loss from physical exertion by 10%. Yep. I am sick of this food and water being an issue for us. Run back over to our horde base. Plant a couple of trees. There we go. Let's just finish a couple little upgrades. I am definitely not the first one to do this. I think this is probably the most common thing anybody does for their horde. And I'm just gonna copy it. I've actually never done it this way before. So it's a first for me. Let's get it all buttoned up here. I think I'm going to have to worry about vultures tonight, so I might just leave the top open. Then we can drop them down to our spike pit there. Hold them here. And fall back here if we need. Let's see, what do I need? Upgrade these. Cobblestone? Or iron? Not sure. I don't even really think... Need too much more of these, but since we've got them, I'm probably just gonna put up a couple spikes around here. Ah, crap. I missed that one, and that's gonna drive me crazy. I guess it can't hurt nothing. Very good, and then I'll probably put spikes up here. But we'll do that when we come back later. Alright, let's head to Trader Joel's. Let's see if we got a thing of water first. Great. All right, so we're gonna go to the traders. Let's take some of these things that I know we can sell. Um, we're gonna sell more brass, these knuckles. Not like we're gonna get much for it, but I'll sell them those. Some of the mechanical parts. Yeah, let's see if we'll buy the gas. Sell them the springs. Sell them a wheel. Yep, all right, so I'll do it. Might as well take our dukes with us too. Like we have much, but. Every bit helps, right? Alright, so if I want to get to Trader Joel's, I just need to head straight down that road.
All right. Huh, that's interesting. I didn't know I could take those books. I can take these ones too. How long have those been there? Wiring 101. Improves electrical crafting skill. And improves rifle crafting skill. The rifle world. Cool. Hey. Joel is horde knight. I want a job. And I want it to be close. I've got just the task for you. Okay, go retrieve the shipment and return it. Thank Will you. do. I bet you wouldn't do this for just anyone in the wasteland. Would you? Just you, Joel. Just you. Whatever keeps me working, buddy. Alright. Much obliged, stranger. Where is that? Are you kidding me? Okay, that's just the burnt forest. It's like I'm going into the wasteland. And we're in a way better spot than we were before. But you have a water, and I can afford it. It's been a real pleasure. You watch yourself out there. Alright. Let's go fetch some supplies. To the burnt forest. Fuck off, Marvin. I don't have time. Do I have time to kill this chicken, though? Nope. Maybe I don't. What is this? Judy Witch, huh? Is this even where I want to be? Nope. I don't think I want to fuck around with Judy right now. Alright. Alright, we are going around. Yeah, that looks like more than I want to bite off. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, looking good, looking good. Nope. Not fucking with you, pal. I am not fucking with you. Alright, we are not double dipping. We are just going to hit this thing and get after it. And what a great looking place it is. Alright. Started. Was that a chicken I just saw? Okay. Supplies are above me. Alright, that's gonna be our way out. Uh huh. Back off, pal. Jeez, you went flying. Oh, Jesus, party girl. Ugh. There we go. Holy crap, you can actually get water from that. That's great. Workstation crafting skill. Yes. We we'll use that immediately. Ah. Down, buddy. That unlocks that. All right, hey, pal. Huh? Down, Joe. All right, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Let's head up. Uh huh. The two of you. All right. Okay. Another one down. Alright, worth it to hit the crates. The crates are worth it. We got some books. Take it, keep moving. What's out here for me? What's gonna jump me? Magnum Enforcer, Volume 7. And we need to keep going up somehow. Hate me if you want. Son of a bitch, I probably deserve that. God damn it. Excellent. There are the supplies. Hmm. We're not going to finish picking this whole place. That was a success. Alright, get out of this goddamn burnt forest.
Right, come on, Joel. We did your job. Even though you tried to kill us. No more send me up to the burnt forest, huh? Alright, um... Slayer liner mod. You know what? I think we will do that. We'll take that. Oh, cool. That was the last one we needed to do to move on to the next tier, so we just got ourselves a bike. Yep. We will take the bike. Oh, I'm stoked about that. What? Do you have another... No, you don't have another filter. I will buy your two waters. I will buy your bacon and eggs. You do have filters. Why'd you say you didn't have filters? I would've bought a filter. <laughs> Dang it. So that's in the resources, huh? I don't have anything I can sell you now to make that up. All right, at least now I know. Any special jobs? Tier two, open trade routes. Yep. Oh, All right, will do. I will make it worth your while. All right. Well, after we get through Horde Night, we'll know what we're doing next now. All right, Joel. It's been real. Let's get back home. Start doing a little prep work. You know what? We might as well ride our bike. <laughs> All right. Whoa, okay. Why am I steering with that? Okay. <laughs> We've got a bike. Oh, that's so much better than all that running we were doing. It's gonna save so much time. All right, so we're here. Let's just gather up everything I want to use for the Horde Knight. Alright, let's go button up a couple of things. And did I get a level earlier? Nope. Alright, I'm not even sure how much more I want to do to this, but what I am going to do is... Build a... Yep. Craft that. Mm -hmm. Okay, now this is gonna have everything that we're gonna use for the Horde Knight. Okay, well, we're getting close to Horde Knight, but not that close. Let's uh, chop down a couple more trees, make a couple more spikes, and then get ready. I think I made some torches put up so we can see nice and easy. Uh-huh. Oh, there's a wandering horde right there. Put all my ammo up there, didn't I? Yeah, that was smart, Steve. Okay, so these wandering hordes have a better chance to drop bags, I think. I think we can do it. Oh, she knows I'm here. Yep. That was exactly what we wanted. Right? Bring it, Marvin. All right, we're going loud. Get back, buddy. Excellent. Nice. See either deal with you guys now or deal with you later, right? Oh, these guys are in my little forest. Hey, just got a scale point out of it. All right. Don't know if it was completely worth it, but we pulled it off. All right, so that'll help us see down here. Lovely. One on one there, and one there. Great. Alright, and we've got the spikes, so let's put them down. Alright, put some on the way up. I feel really good about that. Let's box ourselves in. Alright. 
All right, let's get everything loaded up. All right, we're ready for war. And here they come. Let's do this thing, huh? How's this beer last for a minute? Oh, you guys just died on the spikes down there, are ya? Let's see what's going on out here. Yep. Yeah, they're just kind of attacking the base of it. Oh, they're going for the supports. Oh, man. These guys must not be pathing me the right way. I think some of those blocks I use for the stairs aren't going to let them path up here. Alright, no reason to panic yet. Not until they tear down my whole base, though. Yeah, they're not jumping up there at all. Uh. Alright, that was a fun little first wave. Here comes another. I maybe should have done some science for this first. Yeah, those supports are starting to take a beating. Oh, there goes that. Let's see, will that do it? Hey, that worked. Alright. Now let's line them up. Oh, they're gonna be able to jump over that, aren't they? <laughs> Alright. Later. Oh, God, you got through. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm fatigued. I just blew half of her head off. Let's drink that beer. Okay, we're through, huh? my lesson on that one. Jesus, I am all kinds of messed up now. Holy shit. Alright. Well, you live and learn, I guess. Let's see. Can I get some of these bags? Alright. Bandages, food, ammo, brass, dukes. Ah, okay, cool. Painkillers. So where did these guys hit? So, they didn't path to me. I wonder if that was because of what kind of stairs I had used, or if it was because of the spikes I put on there, but I feel like once they broke down off of those half stairs I had put, they started jumping up. Yeah, all in all, I would say that was a success. I know what to do for the next one. Good job, Steve.